all women want high value men do you know why she is cheating but you think that this behaviors only belongs to toxic women only women who behave in a certain way consistently that is her behavior and your lady is innocent because you think you feel like she can't play something in front of you you're not a fool and she can't just play you she can't fuck up with your head she can't use that game on you and this is when you are wrong with the pride i think men who know nothing about women are the men who are being played by these women i think men who act in a certain way men who are naive who haven't studied women are the men who are being played and i have a genuine woman bullshit who told you that she is a genuine woman we have to behave genuinely so that you can think that these behaviors belong to toxic women and that confirms that you are a guy who is not high value because you are not aware of this nature of this character in women oh i, I think this is for men who don't know women no in fact men who assume that specific types of women act in a certain way for example women want high value men now when she starts to pull away she will slowly introduce an argument a disagreement chaos that makes sense to you because it's something that you talked about but you never solved fully or it is the past argument that she just decided to bring it up it still makes sense to you and she is not applying a test in a game into how you are low value because you are willingly trying to justify something so that you can solve an existing problem when she knows her emotions will make sense to you so that you can comply to that argument to that disagreement these games it's not about toxic women using it you just have the pride now when you comply she just needs a confirmation that you care the word is care the word is care the word is care when she gets a confirmation that you care and you reacted in a certain way because it also affected you now you are low value remember she is using this game systematically but she's not aware that it is a game but it will make her feel a certain way about you now when she is applying a game she knows that a high value guy won't entertain that bullshit she applied the same game on solomon she applied the same game on johnny and these men communicated care these are the men who are fulfilling survival you are also the guy who is fulfilling survival and no hypergamy now she knows fully that she is safe when you have a disagreement she can go to who to johnny she can go to who to solomon because you are the guy who is slowly just finding something by asking her you can't even see what i have been doing for you you can't even realize what i have done for the relationship that is a confirmation that you can she only needs you to communicate those words by telling her i have done a lot for this relationship i have done a lot for you and you have not even seen that that communicates that you have been doing things for her and you really care you are low value because you're trying to please her because that will keep her interest so that she can always be around you now these games and these tests they are not only done by toxic women most of the time you found out that that lady cheated because she has done it so much she has been practicing it so much and she has reached a place where she wants you to find out that is why you found out about it most of the games most of the toxic behaviors that you name them toxic and you found out is because she wants you to find out because psychological women are always ahead always have a conscious mind and be aware always be alert it has nothing to do he is just his friend and you can trust her he is just a discreet guy and you can trust her they are just doing a job together and you can trust that that guy and you can trust that she can't cheat with a guy who acts in a certain way with a guy who has nothing she can't cheat with a guy who is so low value and he is homeless those are the men that women cheat with and she needs you to know that that is a high value guy who knows that because he is homeless it doesn't confirm that she won't cheat in fact it gives her the upper hand that this is the guy who will comply and cheat with her and this is the guy who will keep the word because he doesn't want to lose the girl who has everything because the guy won't provide anything rather to just enjoy the sexual gratification and he has the cake so assuming and always confusing yourself mm, i am different these games 
these tests, they are applied on naive men, on men who don't understand women, on men who don't know who women are, on men who haven't dated a lot. No, it's just a game that will be applied to you directly, indirectly, just to gauge how you know how women operate. Again, this is the second time I have done this video and it is really, really making me struggle because of the background noise. I am so pissed because there was this guy who has been in a relationship or rather marriage with a woman for 10 years and then eventually he finds out that the lady has been cheating on him for the past five years and then he tells me that is why she has been starting arguments unnecessary because those arguments get you engaged and it allows you to pay attention to the argument and not to her behavior because you can't realize that she has been cheating on you and you found out because she wanted you to find out she has been cheating for five years and you think this is a toxic behavior and it's a behavior that belongs to certain types of women bullshit get out of your head and deal with the reality as it is it doesn't belong to certain types of women today she will wake up she will feel in a certain way and then she will start a disagreement then you will feel bad so she will pull away but she will get another man that she will connect with emotionally because that day arouses her emotionally and then she will come home continue with the same argument pulling away nose will cause you to be frustrated and now she got you because emotionally she has you any guy who cares who really loves her she knows how to hook him how to hook him up and she can finally go have another guy that she, she wants to have fun with but you will think that hmm, this is just an existing issue that i need to solve no the moment you try to work on that thing then you are low value but the moment you try to ask just ask just be open and ask what do you want and then have a broader conversation so that she can open up and get to the clear point when she tries to escalate everything just tell her i'm not going to deal with this bullshit and be willing to walk away and walk away and mean it most of you guys you are emotionally invested and you think you think that she can't cheat on you she is cheating on you either emotionally physically intimately or she is planning to when you assume that you got her you have her she can do anything she is faithful she is the innocent one she's not toxic she's always nice she's always good she's always understanding she's always trying to please me no she can please you to blind you then turn a black eye with johnny because isaac is so dumb to notice that this is just an act to get him hooked so that he can think that genuine love exists but I need to maximize men to gauge who among these men fulfills hypergamy more and fulfills survival more. Hmm. Yes, you never saw that coming. Like the other guy who asked me, that was disappointing. You have been with her for 10 years, but you realized a month ago that she was consistently cheating on you for the past five years. Five, five years, five years. And you tell me, you thank God that you found out. No, she let you find out because she's tired with you. When she holds back the sex, high value men communicate. If she doesn't comply, she doesn't do things, she doesn't respond to your need, you just tell her, I don't think if it will work because you know, you know, you need it as a man. Women don't value sex, no. I can sleep with you today, Isaac, but tomorrow in the morning, I will wake up and I will just feel like blocking you and I will do it because that is just how I feel even after I have slept with you. It's not that serious. It's not that important and they are never attached, especially sexually. It doesn't matter how the sex was good. Don't even lie to yourself. Oh, she can't do this to me, my friend, my friend. <laughs> Because you think that you are special and she really genuinely loves you. And that is when, that is when you are totally fucked. The pride. Get out of your head. See you next time.